guys feeling super sluggish right now you know why and brainless too because i just forgot my keys ah. so the reason why i'm like super sluggish right now is because if you just saw my snapchat all right guys it's going down i've got two singles some fries i just couldn't do the soda water it is chug life I just ate at In-N-Out Burger. And I just didn't eat like a normal In-N-Out Burger. I got two singles, two fries, which I haven't had French fries in so long. And it has just beat me up. So I gotta get out and get some activity. I really would love to get a workout in, but I have to go to Costco first. I need to get some food. The reason why we did eat at In-N-Out Burger for lunch was because we didn't have any food at home. Tip number one, make sure your fridge your kitchen is always stocked full of good foods. So that's what I'm gonna do right now, heading to Costco, and I'm taking you along with me. Make sure you bring your Costco card though. Traffic. Nothing but the best way to spend your time. That's why you should be listening to my podcast, Ask Luke Lean TV Podcast. If you're not listening to that yet, go download it on your phone and listen to it while you're sitting in traffic. So much traffic, there's even like parking guys in Costco to tell you where to park. Money. All right, let's go battle the lines of Costco. How many of you guys shop at Costco? I'm actually very interested to know. Do you guys have Costco in your city? Comment below, let me know. Okay, so we just arrived at Costco. It's time how long we're gonna be here for. Put your guesses in the comments. Let's go. Guys, my blender just literally broke at home. And I actually, one of you guys, I can't remember who it was, somebody on Instagram said, I'm buying you a new blender. Well, we need a new blender, but I need it right now. So I gotta buy one. I gotta go with this guy again. It's a cheap one, but it's got glass. That's what I like about it, it's got glass. Everything else, like the Blendtex, the Vitamix, they are plastic, and I don't like putting my hot coffee in plastic. So, let's go with one of these things again. Stay. I would totally have some fun with this guy. Maybe in the new condo. Fun fact, Jessica loves these. Look at the size of this box. She would just destroy me if I brought this home for her. <laughs> I actually tried before and she said, don't bring that into the house. That's another tip. Don't bring junk food in bulk into your house. Organic ground beef. Looks like it's grass fed, but I don't think it actually is. Tricky, tricky. You got the organic chicken here, but I like to get that frozen. Go down the aisle a little bit further, and they got the organic ground turkey, which I like. Yes, seasoned dry tip. And I remember one time I was shopping at Costco, and the lady that works there says that they appreciate the meat fed up the meat for them so they don't have to touch it all day when you check out, so good deal. One thing I don't like about Costco is they don't really have any wild salmon. They have firm salmon, which we're not a huge fan of. And they don't have cod either. Looking for cod, don't see it. Chunky guacamole sounds good, but anytime you buy something packaged, you have to look at the ingredients. Let's see what we got here. That is live lean approved. Into the cart you go. Yes. Yes. Cauliflower makes the best type of low carb potato mash. Brussels for the muscles. Yes. 
been in. Hot pie does it. Guthrow does it. Organic eggs. Yes. Let's get two of these bad boys. Hopefully I'm banking on none of these being broken. Lemons. Get in there. Hang out with your homies. Bananas. What you know about damn apples? Onions make any dish taste better. You know I'm all about damn avocados. Yep. When you're all about it, you gotta go big. Salsa. Olive oil. Balsamic vinegar for dressings. You don't need to buy store-bought dressings. Oil, vinegar, done. Hot sauce. Spice up any of your meals. Make it taste a whole lot better. And spicy. Nuts. Let's go with almonds today. Not, uh, Pecans, but let's go. Almonds, baby. Almonds. Now, guys, don't be afraid to put salt on your food. If it's sea salt or like a pink Himalayan salt, when you buy foods like this that are all whole foods, one ingredients, no salts added to them, adding your own healthy salts is definitely okay. Black pepper, another spice that you can never go wrong with. Buy it in bulk, keep it stored. Now I also like no salt seasonings. It's a mixture of a bunch of different spices. Keep it stored, put it on any like your chicken, anything. Makes it taste a whole lot better. And I also like garlic powder, but this is garlic salt, so I don't want that, but they don't have garlic powder here. Oh, found it. My bad. This is the one that I normally go with. And of course, cinnamon. Cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon. And some sort of like pasta, tomato marinara sauce to add to chicken, meat, whatever. Love to have this stuff to add extra flavor, extra creaminess to your proteins. So guys, I think that is it. Let's get up in the lineup, get out of here and see how long this took us and how much it's gonna cost. And we're out. Let's move, let's move. Uh, let's check out the time, how long it took. 49 minutes and I'm on my way back to the car. And just another thing guys, always return your cards back to the bin with the rest of them. Just think, little things you do in life, like I've always said, it shows a lot in what you do to make things your life a good person. Now I know we always get the question, how much do you spend on groceries? Well, let me show you guys. I got the receipt right here. We spent, see if you can see that. I'm gonna pull it right down here and show you guys. So I know it's zoomed in. Right there. $215, but we got $100 off. Why do we get $100 off, you ask? Because of people like you. So we had one of our uh, followers on Living TV sent us a $100 gift card to Costco as a special thank you. And uh, uh, just a congratulations present for giving birth to Kyla. So Joe K from Boca Raton, Florida, thank you so much for that Costco gift card. And you saw we're turning that $100 gift card into gains. Let's go home. Now we have to get all these groceries in the house just by my shelf. So guys, there's an example of when you're feeling like crap, you're lazy because of the food you ate, because you didn't have any food in the house in the first place, but when you get out, you get the food. Movement creates action. Action creates results. No more bad eating. We got the food in the house now. Now we just have to get it up inside the house. So I made it in, carried the groceries in, got the groceries put away. Kyla's just waking up right now. Hi, huh, baby. Hey, Kai. Say hi to all the live leaners. <laughs> Baby's crying. I got to go. 
All right, guys, we're getting ready to film an Ask Lively TV podcast for you guys. If you guys haven't been checking out the podcast yet, or if you haven't subscribed to the podcast, go over to iTunes, go do that. Or you can watch it here on YouTube as well. But like I said before, I like you guys listening to the podcast in your car. And, you know, whenever you have free time, walking the dog, walking the family, walking the baby. So you ready to go, boo? Yep, I think so. I think she's going to stay quiet, I hope. Yes. You have to stay quiet. Quiet on the set. We need a nanny to watch the baby when we're filming. You okay to chill? Can I trust you to just chill? All right, dude. Pound it. We're all ready to go. We're mic'd up. Equipment's all set up. And then that. Ah, oh, Kai. You're not gonna let us get this done? You gonna let us work? What do you think? I don't know. What do you think, Bru? She might be still hungry. Bru, I thought you were gonna babysit. Can't you babysit? <laughs> okay, don't look this way. Don't look this way. Okay, so that was a fail. She wouldn't let us work. Can't have that happening when we're filming. So we decided to take Bru out for a walk, take Kai out for a walk. And we're gonna call that a night. We'll have to pick up tomorrow when she's sleeping. That's just what you have to do when your parents gotta work around your little baby schedule, I guess. So we're gonna pick up with that Ask Living TV podcast tomorrow, but you guys are gonna see this vlog tomorrow as well. So thank you guys for watching and keep living lean. Boy. Say goodbye. Boy. Say goodbye, bro. Boy. Can you say goodbye? Boy. Okay. <laughs>